When we walked in today, you were smiling. Big smile. Tell me why. Since you guys came on the last time, which was like a week ago, um, when I was having trouble with trespassers, um, everything's been going well. A transformation for Harlem residents after reaching out to PIX11 News. Tonya Bacon says she finally feels comfortable walking into her building again. I haven't seen them. <laughs> I haven't seen them, so that's been great. It's been peaceful. Earlier this month, Bacon introduced us to her neighbors. They were tired of teen trespassers in the lobby each night for hours, hanging out and harassing residents, including senior citizens and parents. And a bunch of kids were sitting in here threatening me, you know, to hurt me, and I'm on the cane. I have three disability children that I literally had to take them to school myself because they would always say something to my kids. They're rolling up marijuana, they're throwing trash on the floor. Bacon says she knew it was time to get help after she was cornered in the lobby by several teens, including a girl threatening her with brass knuckles. All of the residents we spoke with had the same request. Security. We need security. It's crazy. Um, we have no protection. We have no security guards. We reached out to the building management for our initial report to ask about the calls for more security. While they did not respond to us directly, residents say their message was heard. Days after our story aired, there is now a doorman in the building during the evening hours when residents say those teens used to take over. I kind of knew already if they seen someone here that they wouldn't enter the building if, you know, they walked by. Uh, we believe that had this story not been covered by you, uh, nothing would have been done. And Bacon tells us police officers in the local precinct have been responsive and collaborative as these residents hope the progress here will be permanent. So thanks to you, Ayana, and WPIX. And the residents tell us they also have concern for the teenagers that were hanging out here. They hope they're able to find more productive and constructive ways to spend their evenings.